Hi, this is Dan Whitney with the Whitney Law Firm in Towson, Maryland. If you're watching this video, it's because you're probably looking information about the issue of, I found termite damage after closing on my house. So I handle, uh, and my firm handles cases involving termite damage in uh, houses uh, that somebody just bought in a new house um, and what to do about it. So buying a house, of course, is extremely expensive and it can be stressful. And there's a lot of moving parts that most people just assume that the right thing, the right inspections are being done. Um, and oftentimes that works, but when it doesn't, it can be a huge, big problem, an expensive problem. And when it's something like termite damage, um, there really is no way to ignore it because once you know about it, um, the damage may be spreading. And of course the damage has to get fixed uh, in order to preserve the structural integrity of the house, depending on how bad the damage is. So the way that most people discover termite damage in a new house is after they close, um, they'll move in and within weeks or months, they'll come to find either, uh, either the termite swarmers themselves uh, flying or on the ground. Uh, they may find uh, cracks in the wood. They might find what looks like sawdust popping out. They may look in their basement or somewhere where there's wood and realize that wood doesn't look right. Uh, and do some investigation, maybe pry it uh, with the screwdriver and find there's damaged wood. And of course, the issue once you find the termite damage is, well, what am I going to do about it now? So the good news is um, there, depending on how you did your purchase of the home, there are a number of parties that may have been or may be responsible for uh, finding that damage and bringing it to your attention uh, before you bought the house. And that is who you would look to uh, to determine who uh, you may, able, may be able to recover compensation from to, to properly repair uh, the termite damage. Those parties uh, that, that we have uh, brought lawsuits and claims against in the past to recover compensation so our clients could repair the damage, those parties uh, often include the, the seller, of course, um, uh, potentially a real estate agent, either a the buyer's or the seller's agent, because there's duties of disclosure on both ends. Um, even For example, even if a, a uh, real estate agent represents the seller, if they know about termite damage, uh, in Maryland at least, they certainly must disclose that damage. It's a material fact and they have a duty to disclose all material facts uh, to all parties. So the seller, the real estate agent, and of course we cannot forget the um, the WDI inspector or termite inspection contractor. Um, there's a lot of cases uh, against them in Maryland where they simply um, don't find, or they say they don't find damage that, that they should have seen. Uh, and of course, had they seen it and they put it on the report and the potential buyer saw it, the potential uh, buyer could have said, well, I see there's a problem, let's either investigate it further or they could say, you know what, I don't want any termite damage, I'm out. Um, we see a lot of termite damage uh, cases arising out of houses that are flipped because, of course, the flipper has no real good incentive to do a, a solid job most of the time. They just want to flip it, hide any damage, or sometimes they hide the damage and then sell it to the next unsuspecting person who sees maybe a beautiful kitchen or some beautiful bathrooms or beautiful new floors. And it's not until after they close that they realize, uh-oh, you know, we've got termite damage in half the house. It's going to be 100000 to fix. What do I do? The good news is, um, depending on the facts of your case, you may be able to recover compensation and take care of the damage and sometimes uh, money for emotional distress as well, depending on what happened and, and who hid what or, or who was negligent or what. Depends on the facts. But the point is, um, you, you, you can find help and you can recover compensation in some situations. So uh, if your case was in Maryland, please feel free to give us a call. Uh, we offer free consultations to uh, homeowners in termite damage cases. Uh, so just, just give us a call or come to the website, uh, WhitneyFirm.com. We've also got some blogs on the website that talk about termite damage and some of the past cases we've handled. Um, so if you're looking for more, more information, please see the site. Uh, we'll be doing more videos on the subject. Uh, thanks for watching. Take care. Bye.